Hello, we are the SpaceX fans and welcome to the SpaceX show, the place where you can stay up to date with everything SpaceX. Kicking off this video with a reminder we can hopefully expect the Crew-6 launch very soon. The Crew-6 mission is scheduled for liftoff tomorrow, Monday 27th at 6.45am UTC or 1.45am EST. In addition to that launch tomorrow, there are two more launches that are scheduled for tomorrow as well. The first of these two missions is the Starlink 6-1 mission currently scheduled to launch tomorrow, Monday 27th at 6.37pm UTC or 1.37pm EST. Then there is another launch scheduled for an hour later. The Starlink 2-7 mission is currently scheduled for tomorrow, Monday 27th at 7.31pm UTC or 2.31pm EST. So assuming all these missions lift off tomorrow, SpaceX will be launching a rocket on every one of their pads in the same day. I wanted to share this tweet from Jared Isaacman marking one year since the announcement of the Polaris program. He said, this year went by quickly and so much progress has been made. It is kind of incredible to think that it has not even been three years since NASA and SpaceX returned human spaceflight to the USA with Demo 2. Polaris Dawn is approaching this summer at KSC. Heading to Boca Chica, further orbital launch mount work including shielding has been going on. The Starlink loader was seen being moved in the production yard. Jeff Faust posted information related to SpaceX and Artemis. It says NASA's Mark Wies says on a panel at Spacecom that he expects the agency to give the formal authorization to proceed to SpaceX for the first Gateway Logistics mission this year planning a 48-month lead time to get it ready in time for Artemis 4 in approximately 2027. Starship 25 was recently lifted off of the Pad B test mount. As we saw in the last video, there was some Ship 26 cryo-testing that took place. As they test Starship 26, Ship 27 was seen fully stacked in the high bay recently. This super-heavy Booster 10 aft section was moved to the Mega Bay. Taking a look at the upcoming Road and Beach closures, all dates for last week were cancelled. They now have possible closures for tomorrow, Monday 27th and Tuesday 28th. As always, I have to say thanks to both Nick Antsuini and Jack Bayer for being out there filming the Starbase content. Also, thanks to the NASA Spaceflight team working behind the scenes on their videos, live streams and other space content. That's it for this episode of the SpaceX Show, I hope you enjoyed the video, if you did, make sure to hit the like button and leave a comment down below. If you want to stay updated with SpaceX info, make sure to subscribe and press the bell icon to get notified when I upload. Thanks for watching and have a great day.